Hello today's video we have the following content. After watching Yang Mi and Xiao Lian together, I realized what showing legs means to be domineering and powerful, and what it means to be deliberately artificial. There is nothing unattractive about Yang Mi's leg shape, but the scene of her legs being exposed in the plot seems quite abrupt. It's puzzling to show off your beautiful legs for no reason while sitting quietly. The audience wondered, what is the meaning of this move? Going against plot logic just to show off your legs? Jushin Hong Hong, a player with extraordinary strength, can destroy spells with just his hands. His reputation is far-reaching, and everyone in the six regions is afraid of him. Under her rule, no one dared to set foot in the Tushin land, and order was maintained. If exposing her legs is to show Tushin Ye's foxy nature, it's not necessary. Compared with Tushin Hong Hong, Ye is more innocent and eclectic. Even the manly sitting posture can be easily achieved by Yeya, showing it naturally. In this drama, Jushin Yeya's performance is impressive. She always maintains composure and solemnity, sitting quietly, showing extraordinary concentration and restrained temperament. Referring to the work walking with the Phoenix, Shen Li has a straightforward, free and informal character, so her sitting posture often shows the style of a man, rather than the softness and elegance of a woman, which has a unique style. The prince seemed quite open-minded. He also raised one leg and put his hand lightly on it. However, during the entire sitting posture, Shen Li cleverly avoided exposing his legs and showed a decent manner. When she crosses her legs, she is wearing a skirt, but when she raises her legs, she cleverly avoids exposing her legs, and her behavior is elegant and decent, without any risk of losing her composure. His eyes were as sharp as knives, revealing firmness and confidence. The bright light could not hide his inner strength. It was obvious at a glance that this person was by no means a kind person. When I am with Fu Lin Jun, I feel more free and relaxed. I have never had a good impression of this fiancé, so I seemed even more careless in front of him than before. I know that Fu Lin Jun is not as powerful as me, so he won't be too picky about me. She has always been accustomed to using a manly posture, often bending one leg. This has become her unique and permanent posture, like a static picture showing her tenacity and personality. Here, the slender legs are still not exposed, and the skirt is low, covering it just right, adding a mysterious charm that makes people daydream and want to explore the mystery underneath. Shen Li was injured in lying quietly, and Zing Zhi came to visit. He originally thought that Shen Li should be disheveled at this moment, showing a little bit of spring. However, what he saw in front of him was that Shen Li still remained dignified, with no trace of her spring revealed, which made people admire her tenacity. During the days when Shen Li was in seclusion to heal her wounds, the description in the original work was particularly straightforward, showing her tenacity and unyielding spirit and desire for recovery. Every detail reveals her firm and perseverance. Shen Li and Jin Yangzi met honestly, but each had their own characteristics. Shen Li was wearing a light lining. Although her posture was ambiguous, she still maintained a decent attitude, and her skirt neatly covered her legs. The Golden Lady, as always, likes to show her legs and show her unique personality. The only time his legs were exposed was after he and Zing Zhi consummated their marriage. At this time, the sitting posture was still the carefree posture of a man, and one leg was finally exposed. However, looking at Shen Li here, it is not out of the ordinary. After all, he had just done something indescribable. It's normal to be exposed like this. After the relationship between the two was established, they became more and more natural when getting along. When they were intimate, their behavior became more and more appropriate. They no longer showed their bodies easily and showed deep and restrained emotions. The leg exposing scene in Walking with the Phoenix is intended to show a charming and sultry style. Through delicate description, it conveys a different kind of charm and charm, which makes people intoxicated. Jushin Hong Hong repeatedly exposed her jade legs in front of Dong Fang Yu Yu. What is the deep meaning? Is this move intended to show his uninhibited attitude, or to convey some indescribable emotion? Food for thought. Regarding the detail of exposing her legs, we can't help but wonder, why does Tu Shan Huang Huang and Fox Fairy Matchmaker appear to be deliberately doing so, while Shen Li in traveling with the Phoenix can deeply touch people's hearts and make people linger for a long time? Unforgettable. In fact, the key lies in the word natural. The scene where Shen Li exposed her legs happened naturally during the consummation of the marriage. It was in line with her role and showed the side of her that a woman should have. But Toshin's red exposed legs seemed to be exposed just for the sake of being exposed. There was no need for any plot, so it naturally seemed deliberate. In an actor's performance art, 
Authenticity and nature are particularly crucial. Overly exaggerated movements or expressions can easily make the audience feel artificial. Only by truly immersing yourself in the character can you present a natural performance, allowing the audience to deeply understand the unique charm of the character. In short, although the exposed legs plot in Fox Fairy Matchmaker and Traveling with the Phoenix is only a small detail, it reflects the authenticity and naturalness of the actor's performances. I hope to see more real and natural performances in future TV series, allowing the audience to truly immerse themselves in the plot and feel the emotions and joys of the characters. Instead of causing drama because of a deliberate action like now. This is probably the reason why Traveling with the Phoenix is about a middle-aged ancient doll falling in love, but it beats Fox Demon Matchmaker by a few blocks. Thank you for watching the video, please leave your opinion in the comments section. Don't forget to press the channel subscription button. If this is the first time you watch a video on the channel,